Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're doing well. In this video, I'm going to give you a demo of the Pioneer MCA CC Auto Tuning App. I have a Pioneer VSX LX503, and I have basically my home theater that I've got. I have no acoustic panels whatsoever, and I want to do a pre-test because in the next video, I'm going to be installing some custom-made acoustic panels. And you'll see from here, I have already got the cloth already printed and I don't have the timber and everything yet because I'm still waiting for um, some restrictions to be lifted so I can go down to my local hardware store and I can pick up the timber that I need. And yeah, so basically if you have a look here, you'll see sneak peek, that's one of the posters. I don't know if you can work out what it is, I'm pretty sure you'll know. Um, but basically I'm going to be making my own acoustic panels and in this video, I want to basically do a test of the Pioneer MCACC auto tuning app, see how well it does considering there's no acoustic treatment in this room. I do have sound deadening material in the walls. Uh, that was done during the construction process, but I have no other acoustic treatment other than thick, nice plush pile carpet and um, quite solid underlay as well as my home theater chairs, and that's pretty much it. Everything else is echo, echo, echo. And I don't know if the microphone will pick it up, but I'll do a clap test. And there is a little bit of echo. It's not as bad as I've heard in some rooms, but because this room does have quite a few things like the, the carpet and the chairs, it does deaden a little bit of the sound, but I can definitely hear it. In some of the bigger movies, like some of the Atmos movies that I've watched, I can hear echo. So that's something I've got to fix. I also don't have any bass traps or anything like that. Um, and I haven't done a proper EQ of the room either. So that will be coming up in the next video after I install my acoustic panels. But for now, I've had a few questions on the MCACC auto tuning app in private comments and also comments left on my other videos. So I thought I'd give you a demo. So stay tuned. Right, so as you can see, I have my tuning microphone, which is set up there in roughly where I would be in the room when I'm watching something. So obviously you have to start with that position first. And I also have my recorder here, which I haven't turned on yet, um, but it's going to record for the video mostly so that you can hear what it sounds like. So first of all, you can see I've basically got the cable running don't know if you can see it there on the carpet it's coming out down my hallway through into my server rack so you can see it is plugged into the MCA double C port on the receiver. Right, so I'm back in the room. Let's close out the, all the external sound because that's what you need when you're recording. I've got the MCA double C app open. And what I'm going to do now is just go and see if I can run a test now, just so that we can actually see what it looks like. So you can see it detected everything, which is good. And it's gonna go on to the next test now.
So as you can see, the speakers have all been calibrated now according to distance that the microphone picked up all the way through to my subwoofers, which that's strange, it just says nine meters because uh, it's not nine meters away, the whole room isn't even that big. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually play a movie now and I'm gonna test it and just see what it actually sounds like. Um, I might go to channel level. That's what it's set for each of the decibel readings. Okay, so my right surround is lacking a bit, it seems. Could be because it's near the front. So interesting to see how it's actually going to sound. Okay, so I'm going to play the Dolby demo that I downloaded from their website. So we'll just have a listen and see. I don't know how the microphone's going to pick it up, but we'll take a listen and see. We'll try another demo. Right guys, thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Drop a comment down below letting me know what you thought and if you could hear any echo or any improvement from the default tuning. So I'd be interested to get any feedback. I know the microphones are not the best. It's very difficult to pick them up. I don't have expensive microphones to do this testing, but bear that in mind because like I said in the next video that I do, where I do the acoustic treatment, I will do a direct comparison in the audio between the two. So yeah, if you like the video, drop a like on it, it helps me out. Hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so that you'll be notified when that video comes up next. And again, a very big thank you for watching and you'll catch me in the next video. Bye for now.